Hey there everybody and welcome to the channel, I'm your host Rama, and in today's video I'm going to be earning a crazy amount of money in Grand Theft Auto Online. As you can see I've just started a sail mission, oh and we gotta enter the plane it says, which means we're doing the Titan mission, but yes I am doing sail missions for special cargo in today's video, which is going to be fun, I guess. I mean, this should be the most money I'll ever earn in a GTA day, because not only am I going to make, well, this lobby's got currently around 25, 26 people in it, so $3.3 .3 million each successful special cargo sale, and then when we add that in, also with my nightclub I'll be selling, hopefully in this lobby, plus my bunker and all my motorcycle club product, yeah, I'm gonna be making a crazy amount of money in today's video. I'm honestly pretty dang excited for this. We're starting off with a Titan, as you can see over in the corner here, and I'm not gonna bore you guys with the missions themselves, so I'll probably just time-lapse these, uh, these things, and then you can see the money pouring into the bank account. Currently, we have 130. What the heck? Okay, well, modders are in the session. Welcome to GTA, where <laughs> fun is your latest departure. First, sail mission complete. Unfortunately, I actually couldn't time-lapse it because it turns out I was out of storage. But as you can see, I have $140 million sitting in my bank account. The lobby wasn't completely full by the time I finished because that modder pissed off about every single player there. But I can't complain. $3 million, even with a not completely full lobby, is a pretty decent payout if you were to ask me. So, what are we going to get this time? We have truck. All right, this should be fairly simple. Goodbye! Ha ha ha! And there you go, sold. Successfully delivered the special cargo. 3.3 .3 million dollars added to my bank account, baby. Sweet! More crates to sell. Here we go. There's still like 30 people in this lobby, and honestly, this one seems a lot chiller than the other one I was in. Enter the plane. Oh boy, another Titan sail mission. Three trips to go in the scariest part of the map by far. Oh boy. I am not excited for this at all. I, uh, I was planning on just like cutting past the moments of, you know, me flying the Titan, because this is a fairly simple one to do, but, uh, oh, I am not excited. My off-the-radar is officially gone, and I gotta fly right over through the windmill farm. Okay, first things first, let's deliver this one, okay, and then I'm thinking let's go for this one, because we can cut past them. Oh, God, no, thank you. Cops can get mad at me for a little bit there. Okay, perfect, so... Let's cut this way, and then I gotta get that last one. Oh, no. Alright, well, we should be fine at least for, uh, crashing over here. Okay. And then let's cut through this way. Let's go around. Uh, okay, cops aren't mad at us. I'm not crashing into these windmills. I'll fly right over. These guys aren't gonna hit me. This is how much courage I have. I'm gonna fly right over them. They're not gonna do anything to me. Oh, my God, they're gonna shoot missiles at me. But it's too late! Sold! Thor 3.3 million dollars. Ha ha ha. Imagine trying to tunnel me and still taking L's. And it does nothing, because obviously this is a Titan with an armor upgrade on it as well. Goodbye, losers. Alright, there you have it, ladies and gents. That is another 3.3 .3 mil added to my account. Off to sell another, another crate warehouse. <laughs> I was gonna try and rhyme it, but then my, uh, my brain kind of died. It, it's quite late, um, so, yeah, that's all I really gotta say. It was sweet, another three deliveries with the truck, which is pretty dang simple. CEO abilities, uh, three minutes is fine, honestly. We only gotta drive a mile, and it's at a really good location. So, uh, yeah, this should be really, really easy to do. I'm heading back. There's somebody really close to my stuff, which is not super exciting, so I am very quickly heading back. And if they come near my stuff, I will murder their family. Sorry, was that a little dark? I mean, it appears that they're not going to it, so we might be fine. I mean, the dude looks like he's in a technical custom anyway. 
which isn't a really scary vehicle, unless he's, like, sitting on the uh, machine gun, but even then, I'm not really too worried. We're just gonna land our helicopter right here. Perfecto. Get out to my bubzard, and, uh, yeah, I mean, this is pretty easy. This was honestly the easiest one I've had yet. It's a just simple three drop off and then uh, and then I'm done. And we're going to get a $9,000 bonus. So we should get $3,300,009 as long as there are over 21 people in the lobby. I'm not 100% sure on that, but uh, yeah. Oh, well, maybe we're not going to get that bonus. I was doing so good. And then, uh, and then that guy just kind of swerved into my lane. But, oh well. You can't win all of them. Let's just keep on making our way through. I think we have one more warehouse to go after this. And then, yeah, we'll have $15 million in our bank accounts. It is kind of insane just how much money you can make doing special cargo. Now, I've talked about special cargo in the past. And for the most part, it's... Okay, really? Really? Okay. Oh my... <laughs> This is my life. But, uh, yeah. Special cargo, for the most part, really isn't a great way of making money. Down to the very simple fact that it just... It takes so much time to fill up. I mean, this literally took me two weeks of grinding to fill up. I mean, I'm happy I filled it, and it was through passive uh, filling, basically. So I barely put in any effort, and there you go. Done. Three million, three hundred thousand... <laughs> done. I mean, that's pretty dang sweet. Okay, so we got one more warehouse to go. And a sell! Okay, please don't be the Titan. I mean, I don't hate that. We got the Titan. I, I was about to say, I don't dislike the Titan. It's not the worst one. The worst is the Cuban. Where did it spawn my Sparrow? What? Where? What? Why? Why did it spawn? Okay. Vehicles, hopefully, if I request my personal vehicle, it will spawn my Presser Mark II next to me. I'm not running all the way. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. Coast is clear. We didn't have to type in a red alert. But, uh, yeah. We gotta do another ten deliveries in the Titan. Which means, once again, I'm probably gonna have to fly over the windmill field. But, uh, I guess we'll worry about that when we get there. This time, I've decided to big brain it when going over the windmill. We're gonna go into Ghost Org now. I've saved it this entire time. You can see we got an annoying buzzard over me, but that's not really anything I'm gonna have to worry about. Once again, this whole group of guys are still... Actually, now I think there's more of them are all over the windmill farm. So, uh, I'm gonna fly as high as possible, try and just drop it off, and then go to my last location. And, uh, this should still be a full lobby, as you can see. We should definitely get the payout. But, because we're off the radar, I doubt anybody's gonna see us, especially because with this one, I don't need to be at a specific height. So we're just gonna kinda dive bomb it. I would say that this is low enough down. I'm hoping that this is. Come on, please! Please! Yes! Oh, that's what I'm talking about. Okay. I missed one drop-off all the way towards the corner. Is it the one right in front of us? Yes, it is. Okay, so this will be fairly simple, and uh, nobody sees us anymore, apart from the buzzard still chasing me. But all I need to do is make my way to this final drop-off, and that is going to be all of our special cargo done. So that'll be, what, $15 million there? Oh, yes, that is what I'm talking about. Done. 3.3 million dollars. Now, we're not done yet. I'm also going to be selling some of my other things. They're obviously not as important, like my motorcycle club and, you know, my bunker. So, I'm going to do that. When it comes to our nightclub, I actually have quite a bit in it. You'll notice my popularity bar is really bad. I've been a little lazy, but it's fine because I've been doing the AFK method. So we're going to grab our 250 grand. Thank you very much. And then we're going to make our way right over here. And we're going to do a sale mission. Now, I've waited for at least a couple weeks. Not a couple weeks, sorry. A couple days for my nightclub to fill up all the way to the top, as you can see. Now we can just do a sale mission for $1.27 million. I think we have to use the mule, which is kind of lame. I gotta be honest, the mule is like the worst of all the delivery vehicles. But it shouldn't really matter too much. Nightclub sales are really quick. They're really easy. They require very little effort. And uh, let's see, what do we have to do? Search the area for the buyer. Yeah, this is literally one of the easiest ones. Okay, well, uh, I'm gonna go complete this one real quick. 
I have a helper? Maybe? I don't know. There's a, there's a dude with an oppressor flying around me, and, uh... Well, we all know that's either the ominous sign for, I'm gonna blow you up, or the other sign of, I'm gonna be friendly. I think he's friendly, because he's not doing anything too bad. Um, we still got a bit of time before, obviously, my ghost orb comes back, just because I finished my titan thing, so... Yeah, so, I'm not gonna worry too much about that. I'm just gonna be making my way down the highway. Wait a sec, where did we have to go? Uh, oh no, we have to go past the windmill farm. Oh, uh, this is not gonna be fun. Well, oh well. Oh boy, we're heading towards Death Alley once again. This is like the sketch area. All these dudes are red, and they're not in a CEO, so they're red because they've killed a lot of people. I mean, it doesn't worry me too much because at the end of the day, it's just uh, GTA pixels on my screen when it comes to money. And I mean, I got the oppressor behind me that appears to be actually quite a nice guy covering me. I don't know if he knows who I am or he's just chilling out and covering, uh, but I can't complain. It's, it's free money, right? All right, sounds good. Uh, if this guy's... Oh, I don't have the mines, but you know what? It's fine. I'm just gonna... Boop. Yeah. Oh, I found it. Yes. Oh my god, that guy took an L. Okay, we found it. I mean, the guy wasn't that scary, but uh, we did it. Ayo, leave the area. All right, I'm taking your Prius. Uh, it's it's a nice car, and it's mine now. Thank you. Speeb, 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 speeb. <laughs> that poor guy. Is that a Zentorno? I don't know what it was, but he, he learned his lesson quite quickly. See? There are nice people in GTA, and look at that, we made 1.76 million dollars because we also completed it with the high demand bonus. Alright, first things first, we're gonna sell my coke. I know I got a teeny bit of supplies left, honestly, I could care less. I'm selling it, I'm grabbing the profit, and I'm bailing, so... $367,000, maybe it'll only be, uh, two vehicles instead of three. I guess we'll find out. I'm just waiting for it to say enter a van. You know what? Enter a boat. Fairly easy. And done! Successfully delivered. $569,000. I mean, boats are super easy, so... I honestly didn't really worry that much. But there you go, 569000 I can't complain. It appears that Rockstar has made the game a little bit Halloween-y, as my screen has suddenly gone from a normal tint to a very, very ugly... Uh, like burnt toast tint. Oh well, we're still selling of our product. Three hundred and sixty-seven thousand dollars right here. And there you have it. Counterfeit money sold. I literally had like twenty-five seconds left to sell it, but five hundred and fifty-one thousand dollars, and that's what I'm talking about. All right, we are rolling in the dough. Oh my god, this is the easiest sale mission ever. For some reason, the weed business is always my favorite. Like, every time I sell my weed, no matter what, it always gives me just the easiest sale mission. So I, uh, I can't complain. All we gotta do is deliver this five miles. And, uh, we are in a lobby with, I think, 30 people. So, this will be pretty good money. Ah, okay, we're fine. <laughs> We're fine. This was honestly the easiest sale mission I've ever had. Not a single person tried to attack me, apart from, I guess, the motorcycles behind me, but that doesn't really count. Nobody, nobody wanted to mess with me, which is fine. Except the freaking AI! Go away! Alright, so I know that we have to drive around this. I always, when I first uh, was selling from my weed plant, I always tried to drive through there, and then I realized that you actually can't. But, here we go, turn around the corner, it only took me five minutes, and boom, 466,000 banked in my account. Heck yeah. That was easy. That was honestly really easy. I mean, we didn't make as much money, only 368,000. We still got the full high demand bonus. It's just a little unfortunate that we weren't able to get any more money out of it, down to the simple fact that, uh, well, yeah, it wasn't very filled. As you can see, my bunker actually has a fairly decent amount of product in it. It's two resupplies, so it should be around 420,000 in here. I didn't fill it up anymore because I know that once you get it up to, like, another resupply, then you have the chance of having three vehicles, where I really only have the chance of having two. So, yeah, 430,000 to confirm and sell. Please don't be the buggies. If it's the buggies, this will be a little bit challenging. If it's not the buggies, then this should be fairly easy. 
what do we have? It looks like we have two marshals. Honestly, pretty dang easy. There we have it. Finished my sale for my bunker. That was really easy. I mean, two marshals, three of them can be really sketchy on how much time left you have. But two of them, I mean, it's pretty dang simple. So there you go. Grab my marshal and $645,000 banked into my account. So let me deposit my money really quick from May's bank. And then I also have a Cayo Perico heist that is ready to go. Yeah, so that's what I'm talking about. Sometimes it pays off to go to the airfield, and this was one of those times. Give me the Coke. Give me the Coke. This is definitely just Coca-Cola. Don't, don't worry about it. This is just powdered Coca-Cola syrup, you know? Tastes better, in my opinion. That's why, I mean, it's worth so much, as you can see. Yeah, don't, don't worry about it. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen, I have finished the Cayo Perico heist. I kind of made a bit of a mistake, you can see I got a couple, uh, couple blood wounds on my body. I may have, uh, angered the guards on my way out, but I still passed, and... I mean, we should still get a pretty decent junk of money from this. It was only on normal mode, so not too bad. 1.56 million dollars. I'm not sure if we got the Elite Challenge. Yes, complete under 15 minutes. Zero hacks failed, and... Full loot bags, that's what I'm talking about. So, add on another 50,000. 1.61 million dollars from that heist. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. This was a fun and a little painful video. It took about three hours to do everything. Not actually that long, uh, all things considered. And, I mean, we got a lot of money. So, now what we're going to do is just see how much money I earned. I know I started off the video with $137 million in my bank account. So, once we deposit this final $1.618 million... We are going to see how much money we've made, which is a, a pretty exciting thing, honestly. I'm really, really excited. So right now, uh, it's not telling me. Oh, there you go. We got $158 million in our bank, but we have to deposit this. Go to May's Bank. Depositing the money. Here we go. Yes. So we have 159995000 So I'm just going to count that as $160 million. And uh, so $160 million, what does that mean? We made $22 million, right? One, three, eight plus 22. Yeah, so we made $22 million in three hours. Honestly, that's pretty insane. Hopefully, as always, you enjoyed today's video. If you'd like to see more like it, please consider smashing that subscribe button down below. But, uh, yeah, other than that, uh, hopefully, I guess you learned a thing that you can do all this solo, because I did do all this solo, so yeah, hopefully you enjoyed this, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye!